Once fans got to Syracuse, it was time to tailgate and get ready for the game. Hundreds of UVM supporters showed up for that match, and NBC5 Stephen Biddick spent the day with the Catamount faithful and has more on what they were up to today. Hey, Stephen. Liz, UVM fans may have left Syracuse disappointed, but they once again showed up loud and strong to the game today like they have had all season, and they left it all in the stands. On Saturday, UVM fans from all over making the trip to Syracuse to support their catamounts. It's one of the bigger things in Vermont, UVM. It's called Vermont, so they kind of represent the state too, right? So I think people kind of get into that. Hundreds of UVM supporters not letting the wet and extremely windy conditions ruin their tailgate. We've been working on this all year. <laughs> you know, us, us supporters, us family, and uh, the boys are running hard. They love this weather. We love the weather too. UVM had not made it to the NCAA tournament quarterfinal since 1989. And for some UVM fans, this was a moment they will never forget. Special team, you know. Teams like this just come together once every 10 years. And if the boys, you know, are coming together, we're just starting to find our stride. So we really have no problem with this game. And while the 2-1 to one result was not the ideal circumstance fans were hoping for, it was once again quite a season for the UVM men's soccer program and their fan base. Live in Syracuse, Stephen Biddick's NBC5 News.